Can I keep it real with y'all? YouTube family! What is good, man? We are back for yet another one. Your boy Jay does have some early, earliness for y'all, man. So first of all, what I need y'all to do, as always, keep the street going. A hundred, I was about to say a hundred K. A th I mean, 100K would be cool too, but a thousand likes, man. Run it up, man. Hit that like button for your boy real quick. Opening up the video. Before we dive into it, go ahead. Run them likes up. That's all I ask of y'all, man. Come on. Your boy Jay gonna hit y'all with the content. Y'all just hit me with the likes, man, as well as your feedback. Let me know your honest feedback as I will do because I'm gonna keep it a buck with y'all. I gotta, I gotta talk to y'all about this shoe, but this shoe that I do have is a highly anticipated shoe that is set to release in... 2023 sometime i might put the date up on the screen Bow, there you go right there that's the date that they are releasing as of right now of course we are two or three months out ahead of that time so that date is scheduled to change so depending on when you're watching this video that date could or could not be what it is right there but anyways we're about to talk about those shoes before we dive into it if this is your first time stopping through rocking out with the fam and your boy jay you know what i'm saying we would love for y'all to stick around hit that subscribe button Join the fam, man, as well as hit that notification bell so you can't get notified each and every day. Well, almost each and every day when I do drop these videos, you will know what's coming up and all that good stuff. Follow me over on Twitter as well, too, because I will give y'all a heads up about what video will be dropping that current day or the next day or however I want to do it. So give your boy a follow over on Twitter. Do not forget Instagram. I'm on TikTok as well, too, if y'all want to follow your boy over there, but I'm not as active over there. But that is my social medias, man. But today we do have a first look of some upcoming Air Jordan 5s. And that is the Air Jordan 5 UNC, or they might call them University Blue by the time they drop. This shoe, in my opinion, is something very, very familiar. I know y'all have heard the saying before that Jordan brand is running out of ideas. And I think I'm agreeing, bro. I think I'm agreeing. Um, it definitely looks like something that I have seen before. I was really anticipating the look at this shoe. And when I got them, I was like, they cool. I understand them. But it's going to be a, a consolation prize, in my opinion. I will get more into that in the video. But hear me out. I think that it's a consolation prize. But before we get into that, man, make sure that you guys are traveling the right way. What better way to travel other than Soul Premise? Appreciate y'all. Bang! Right here, Soul Premise, the only way to travel. As you can see, I do have a premium Soul Premise bag right here. This bag goes by the name of a daily commuter. So this is a daily bag. You can use it for your daily needs. You can put your lunch, your clothes, your laptops, accessories, your yeah. shoes. Definitely, you can put some shoes up in here. Let me show you real quick. They do have a slot right here on the inside of this top pouch that can hold two pairs of shoes. So you can put one pair up here at the top. You can put another pair right here at the bottom. Then you can turn around and you can secure a laptop or any other computer accessories that you might have, man. So take advantage of a sole premise bag today. Use promo code Jada Sneaky Guy at checkout. It will save you a good percentage off this bag almost half off so take advantage of that wow supplies last and everything is linked down below in the description other than that this is the pretty blue i want to see some more of this blue man so let's check out what this video is about my god bang so here we have today's shoe early shoe we are in 2023 as i always tell y'all but this shoe right here was supplied by the homie bird kicks shout out to my guy travis over there man make sure y'all check him out he is over on instagram you can dm him on any of the shoes that you see that i tell you that i got from him and he might have your size he might not because he sells them pretty quick but i'm telling y'all early shoes are not cheap i do it for the fam i want to give y'all a first look to help y'all make up y'all mind this is a shoe channel but if you want them early you might gotta pay a little uh, price on them but today's shoe man we do have an upcoming shoe the air jordan 5 in the university blue or unc colorway size tag on this one reads air jordan 5 retro se color blocking is what i did say university blue black white this is a size nine and a half i really usually go around true to size on my size size nine or i can even do an eight and a half but for this in particular case nine and a half was the only size available i can do a nine and a half so i just grabbed them i said let me just let me just get them and see what they're looking like but as you take a look at this box on the bottom you can see it does have those hits of blue it does got that blue on the bottom of the box of course blue jump man that y'all did see everything else is black when you pop open the lid you will get a lot number 
you will get a quality control sticker right there at the bottom and there is also a white and green sticker inside the box we'll get to that in a second but for now we got some shoes in here that we got to get into so i'm gonna be real with y'all y'all let me know y'all thoughts on the air jordan 5 bang university blue aka u and c's so here they are man a shoe that is set to release early first quarter 2023 first first look at them man and um it looks like a shoe that i've seen before that's why i said i think jordan brand is kind of running out of ideas and when i say that they look like a shoe that i've seen before i mean it does look like a shoe i was gonna change my statement but it definitely looks like a shoe look at that white and green sticker right over there in the box as y'all can see but that's not what we're talking about but here we have them man here we have the kicks bang the air jordan 5 unc university blues set to release i want to say in march I think march but i did put that date up earlier but these right here all right if you guys are familiar with any of those air jordan 5s that has recently released the green apple jordan 5s the yellow jordan 5s the michigans the michigan jordan 5s which was one of the first ones that came from such a pack which had that tag on the back i remember the first time we've seen that tag on the back of an air jordan 5 y'all went berserk y'all was like no sir i i hate it i hate it but right now as of right now the masses are ready for this shoe this shoe right now has a lot of hype behind it a lot of people are ready to see this shoe in hand and say that they're ready to buy them and all that good stuff but they just all right to me man um I'm, like i said i'm gonna keep it real with y'all not gonna hype them up because this is not a shooter that i, I feel like i'm gonna go crazy over because it, it looks like something i have seen before what i mean by that oh, appreciate it i only got one hand but appreciate it appreciate it all right bang y'all know what box this is if you are a sneakerhead you know what box this is i'm doing this with one hand because i'm holding these up so take a good look at those real quick while i get these out but doing it all with one hand job, so bear with me all right familiar looks very familiar so when you have this shoe that i have right here oh boy let's see how i'm doing this okay let's do that like that here we go let's just do them both at the same time bang take a look at these shoes right here all right unless you are a university of north carolina super fan or you just love baby blue this is not needed when you have the air jordan fours university blue or unc's and in my opinion this is just my opinion like i always give y'all the university fours are killing these fives that's just my opinion you know um they both do have that same tag on it so it's it's practically the same same thing reversed you know reverse type of touches in different areas you have the tag right there on the back versus here on the tongue and just slight color variations mixed around but it's it's bro this is practically the same shoe to somebody who is not into jordans and stuff and you were to wear these on monday to work you wear these on tuesday to work they're gonna swear that you wore the same shoe two days in a row just keeping it a buck but i feel that you know when i said earlier the constellation prize what i meant by that is if you did not pick up these you got a chance to get these for retail because these are pushing these pushing p right now these pushing close to 500 of them things right now what? so these are up there i mean early you might be looking close to that same price but i feel like if you just wait on these you're gonna be somewhere in the retail ballpark i see these shoes going for like 220 220 to 250 on release day mark my words all the hype is there right now but when these release this will be a 220 dollar shoe so just keep in the butt like i said man i don't want to stare y'all wrong i want to keep it real with y'all i wouldn't buy the shoe early unless you have an event you you you're a thousand there you got your taxes right if you want to blow your tax money and get these early by all means do whatever you want to do it's your money but just just you know like i said giving y'all the game and and telling y'all the wise thing to do i would wait i would wait for these to release to get them for around retail because <sighs> these is beautiful but let's set these to the side and start talking back about these again i think that these are worth just waiting you don't need these right now in my opinion but 
unless you know like i said y'all want them but real quick take a look at it not a bad air jordan 5 not a bad air jordan 5 in my opinion take a look at the bottom it does have those shark teeth right down the bottom which got them blue speckles in it i think that's a dope touch i like that that's like one of the dopest touches of it and that's kind of minor so that lets you know how i mean but i mean what else is there to look at it's an all over blue shoe so it's not too much to go over of course you got your white cage on the side which does have that light blue hit behind it that probably would have been dope feel me feel me on this one it would have been dope right if they would have had that white cage but where it has that blue material behind it if they would have put some white speckles back there I think that would have gave it a little razzle dazzle you know what i'm saying if they had put white speckles on that blue mesh print beneath it that would have did a little something to it man but of course regular air jordan 5 stuff you got your 3m tongue on it nothing different you do got translucent outsoles on the bottom of this shoe man light blue jump man at the top black jordan in the middle these they're not bad they clean but they're just not worth the rush. They're not worth the resale right now. If we keeping it a buck, man. So that is my first thought, my first look on the Air Jordan 5. University Blues, aka UNC, set to release sometime in first quarter 2023. I do not know if I will be keeping these because I got two pairs of University Blue 4s. Two pairs. Dead stock right here, man. Got two of them. So this is dead stock. I got one that I do wear. And overall, I think that this is the better shoe. Just me personally. Y'all let me know your thoughts and opinions on which University Blue shoe you like better. Let me give y'all a better look real quick. One last look of both of them so y'all can let me know. Here they both go. Which one y'all like better? University Blue 4s, University Blue 5s. Which one y'all rocking with? Pretty much both similar, bro. Like, similar. We've seen it before, man. But Jordan brand... I like it, but it's something that I've seen before. It has the same type of sock line that the other previous Air Jordan 5s out of this pack had. Is this like a college pack? You know, because the green apples, what, what? Well, it can't be a college pack because I don't think that was a team. The green, unless it was Oregon. Yes, that green one might have been an Oregon. So, so we got Oregon, we got Michigan, and now we got UNC. So it might be a college pack that they got going on, you know, for the for the masses, because of course the schools got their own designed you know player exclusives which are going for thousands but you know for the general public these ain't bad man so y'all let me know y'all thoughts and opinions on them um of course blue lace lock right there igloo style blue on the front you know and uh no extra laces included but these actually might look good with some lace swaps you know you throw a different color a couple different colors in here it might make them pop man but i will do an on feed for these when it gets closer to the release i probably don't know if i'll be keeping them but that is it for this one your boy jay is checking out early look of the air jordan 5 university blues aka unc joints give me y'all thoughts down below which ones y'all like better let me know is it a shoot y'all are rushing to get is it even on your radar let me know if you agree with me about it's something that we've seen before it's very similar yes it's a different silhouette but if i wear them on two different days or if i wear one this week i wear one next week you might swear that i wore the same shoes both weeks but that is it for this one man your boy jay is checking out air jordan 5's early look on deck shout out to my guy bird give him a follow that is it for this one your boy is gone y'all stay blessed i'm out man peace